Hi, this is Robin Bremer. .net is the website, my blog. And today I want to share with you a scripture that I think is really exciting and I would like for God to take me deeper in this revelation because this is new to me in a sense. And I want to share it with you and uh, I want to get some more insight into it. And the, the scripture is, I'm going to have to take a peek real quick here. Um, um, the scripture, I believe, is in John 17, 3, one of them. It says, um, this is not John 17, 3, but this is another scripture. It says, the eternal life, which was with the Father and was manifested to us. And then the other scripture that I just read says, and this is eternal life that we may know you. Okay, what it is that I want to share with you is, God showed me that a lot of his people think eternal life is just heaven. Okay, when we, when, let me go over this quick. Romans 3 says all of us have sinned. Romans 6 says the wages of sin is death, but the gift of God is life through Christ Jesus. And then Romans 10.23 says whoever, I'm whoever, you're whoever, calls upon the name of the Lord will be saved. Okay, so then you say the quick prayer with me, Father God, I call on the name of Jesus. I want to be saved. I want that free gift. Be my Lord. In Jesus' name, amen. Okay, now remember, you're talking to the Spirit, not the person. So now they're saved. They're on their way to heaven. And now you can pray, Lord, show them how to walk uh, with you in their life, how to have joy, peace, whatever. But, okay, so now people think, okay, I'm on my way to heaven. I have eternal life. But God said it's so much more than that. Just like those two scriptures. He said eternal life is that you may know God, Jesus, and the Holy Spirit. Eternal life is that you may know them. That means to intimately perceive, to know, to like a husband and a wife know each other, to become one. And he says that in the John, it says that we have handled and touched and seen eternal life, meaning Jesus. So not only when you get to heaven will you, <coughs> excuse me, will you know and see Jesus, but if somebody doesn't receive the free gift, who is not saved, they're going to be forever separated from Jesus, from God. They're not going to have peace or joy. They're going to be in torment. They're going to be minus everything good and it's going to be everything evil in hell but not just there but on earth now while we're living we can have eternal life and eternal life is life of knowing God of being in his presence walking in his power like we were created to do so eternal life is all about Jesus eat breathe sleep Jesus um, and all about God and knowing them and this is where we are created to have dominion and authority on the earth. We are created to have fellowship with God. We were created to live in the atmosphere of heaven. And the Holy Spirit is the substance of heaven. So the Holy Spirit is vital. The Holy Spirit is our communicator. He is between God and us, between Jesus and us. The Holy Spirit is like our um, our radio, our, our, our internet connection. Okay, that's it. God said, oh, that's so good. The Holy Spirit is our internet connection with the rest of heaven and the heavenly hosts and the kingdom of God. The Holy Spirit is the muscle of God. The Holy Spirit is a person and a personality. But we need the Holy Spirit. And eternal life is the presence of the Holy Spirit, the presence of God, the power of God. And it's so, so, so awesomely good. So, eternal life isn't just, you can't just expect, like the world does, you get saved, you're going to go to heaven, that's eternal life. No, eternal life is here on earth also. So, um, go to my blog, Bob, <laughs> go to my blog, I get so excited sometimes, go to my blog, robinbremer.net, leave comments, questions, um, Maybe I'll do a video just for you. Leave prayer requests. Um, share, like, subscribe. I'm on Pinterest. I'm on Facebook. I'm on uh, 
MySpace, which I hate. I never really do anything with that. I'm on LinkedIn, which is awesome. Uh, I got over 200 videos on YouTube and also as Ribbons the Clown, which is part of my ministry, outreach ministry. Um, so check it out. Leave me some comments. Let me know you're listening. Let me know that you're being blessed by this and share it with your friends. So I'll talk to you tomorrow. Bye-bye.